Welcome back to Jets Huddle presented by ChevyOffers.com. We've taken you on the field, we've taken you in the locker room, we're bringing you into the main room. This is actually our, our study room, basically our office, a place where we come and we study film and get a lot of things done. Obviously, I get to spend a lot of time with my man here, Kendrick Ellis, number 93. How are you doing, Kendrick? I'm doing all right. Welcome man. to the show, man. It's good to have you on here. We're going to learn a lot about you. And we want to know a little bit more about you. where you're from, where were you born, how were you raised? Well, um, I'm from West Palm Beach, Florida, okay. but I was born and raised in Maypen, Jamaica. And I've been here for about 12 years now, you know, just enjoying living the American dream. So you came from Jamaica, um, came here to the States, lived in Florida. Was that your first exposure to football, or how did football get introduced? It was a Super Bowl in mind when the the Falcons, they were playing the Broncos. Remember that? When John Elway was in this game? Yep. And I was just going to church with my mother, because we lived right by the stadium. I came back home. It was like, what is going on? All these people. I've never seen that many people before in my life. You know, I got into it. I ended up watching the game that night, seeing the fireworks and things like that. And from that day on, I knew what I wanted to do with my life. What was the first time you put on pads and helmets? I actually, I tried to play Pop Warner, but you know, they had a weight limit. So I used to always, which is crazy, I used to always go to the games, you know, hang out. So you out. were too light? Is that, <laughs> is that, uh, definitely yeah. not, definitely not, definitely not. I was overweight, you know, for a kid to play that time. You know, they had 150s, that was the highest pounds they had. So I used to always go to the games with my friends, you know, watch them play. I couldn't play until I got to high school, so I started playing ninth grade, 2002. I started playing for John Leonard High School in the ninth grade. Now, you're raised down in Miami, Southern Florida, and this past week, we just played the Miami Dolphins. Yeah. That's the chance where you just, you got that call, you came in, your jersey was on your pads, and you were ready to go. How was that experience? It was uh, a crazy experience. I never, like, I, I thought I was gonna be, like, out of control hype, but, you know, it was just control, like, just relaxation. And as soon as I got the chance to go in and get that first hit in, I just ran in there, and that's all I, that's all she wrote, man. I just worked my butt off and try to, you know, show up on tape. You know, that's all we used to say, just show up on tape. You definitely showed up on tape and made some huge plays, especially on the goal line. I want you to talk to us about the goal line. They ran a lot, like, twice, kind of like trying to test our right side, which is where you and MTV were at. What were your, your, your mindset? You guys got a lot of knockback. You guys got tackles for losses on that. What was that like? Yeah, it's, they're not in till they're in. You know, Rex, <laughs> that's what he says. They're not in till they're in, you know, and we made sure of that, you know. I don't care what's going on or anything. We're going to give it our all here, make sure we stop them. Right. Now, what are some of your goals now? Your feet are wet now. You know what it's like to play a real NFL game. What is your, your goals going from, from here on out? My goal is just be the best backup to see only I can, <laughs> man. That's all. Whenever anything happens, you're tired or anything, go in and just try not to have a fall off from your level of play. That's my goal. You know, let me tell you something out there, Jets Huddle viewers. You know, Kendrick says backup. In the defensive line room, though, I've always told these guys, we don't have no backups. Everybody's a starter in this room. So, Kendrick, you know, as a starter to another starter, man, appreciate you coming on the show. Anytime. It's uh, great having you on here, and, uh, you know, we'll see you again. All right, definitely.